A tiny robot surgeon that lives aboard the International Space Station has completed its first ever simulated operation in zero gravity. Speaking to CNN, developers of the technology said the Space Mira, which stands for Miniaturized In Vivo Robotic Assistant, performed several operations on simulated tissue while being controlled by surgeons around 250 miles below, in Nebraska, USA. The operation could mark a step forward in developing technology that could help during long-term space travel and establish medical care in remote areas of Earth. It comes as the U.S. continues to push towards exploration in deeper space. How does the robot work? The robot weighs just under a kilogram, and its compact microwave size design makes it ideal for space travel. It makes use of two arms. To mimic the movements of a human, a left arm to grasp items and a right arm to cut, says Shane Ferrator, co-founder and chief technology officer at Virtual Incision, the startup that created Space Mira. Speaking to CNN, Mr. Ferrator said, it gives smaller hands and eyes to the surgeon, on Earth, and allows them to perform a lot of procedures minimally invasively. Space Mira hitched a ride on a SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket on January 30 from Florida's Cape Canaveral Space Force Station and arrived at the space station on February 1. The robot is set to return to Earth in the spring. Findings from its journey could also be valuable for surgery options on Earth, such as helping in rural locations or even on military battlefields. There are a lot of places in the U.S. that don't have access to specialists, and if you could perform telesurgery like this, where you could have an expert dial in from a larger city into a rural area and assist with some surgical care, I think that's got huge advantages, Mr. Ferrator said.